Hi, so I've never really properly introduced myself on this channel. Uh, my name is Daniela. This video is gonna be the first time I'm ever really talking about art on my YouTube channel. I have been wanting to do this for so long, but I don't know why I didn't do it. So I'm doing it today. This is my art and this is what I'm gonna be doing with it. Just woke up, this is what I look like when I wake up. Lips, not moisturized, face, pale. Lashes not on hair like this. Okay So at this point, it's honestly embarrassing. Hold on. Let me sit down for this. Here's Mochi. Everyone say hi So at this point, it's kind of embarrassing that I literally go on YouTube I say oh my gosh I'll update you guys whenever blah 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 and then I just come back on here and act like I didn't just leave for a month not that I'm saying I'm gonna consistently upload but I have been trying to film this video for, oh my gosh, I think like two months now. So let me just recap with you guys. It was about six months ago, I've been wanting to make stickers and do this like really cute thing with, oh wait, I don't know how long ago it was, but it was basically when I got my iPad. So whenever I uploaded my iPad video, it was then. I wanted to like create art, I wanted to start an Etsy and do all that stuff. So I got an iPad and then I wanted to learn how to draw on it. And then about a month before I moved out, I got a Cricut and I'll show you guys right here. So that was supposed to be a video in itself of me unboxing my Cricut, using it for the first time, but you know how my life goes, um, not very smoothly. There was so many things wrong when I first got my Cricut, and then also it was when I lived at my parents' house, so then when I moved over here, I didn't know what to do. I did not know how to use my Cricut. It took me forever to learn how to use it. I finally got it. And then I got a printer. I got this printer. It worked pretty good the first time I used it. It actually worked like a few times that I used it. And then randomly out of nowhere, it just stopped working. It wouldn't connect to my computer. It was a pretty cheap printer. It was like $40. So that was really upsetting because I finally got down my Cricut and then my printer stopped working. And there was just so many things going wrong in this span of time, like trying to figure out how to do Etsy and all of that. Um, so I finally ended up just getting a different printer, which that was also crazy because as you know, we are in a worldwide pandemic and there was pretty much no printers available, I think because everybody's working from home until I got this printer right here. It's the Canon E, wait, it's the Canon IX6826. Okay, it's the Canon IX, Canon Pixma IX6820. Best printer ever. I mean, it's, in my experience, it's like the second one I've used, but I am obsessed with it. I will never go back to an HP one. That Canon one is where it's at. If it's still in stock, I'll put a link. <sighs> now, everything seems to be running so smoothly. I have a lot in inventory, so I'll be able to show you guys what I have. Because basically today I'm going to be trying to set up my shop. You're going to come along with me and see how I do it. Because honestly, I don't even really know how I'm going to do it. I'm trying to figure out all of this stuff for myself too. So right now I have to go deal with something with my apartment. And then I'm going to make some coffee. Uh, so I can have energy. Because last night I didn't sleep. And I'll be back. I'm going to make some coffee. Before I go, I have to go to the post office for annoying reasons. I use this cup since September is tomorrow, which means Halloween is tomorrow. My friend got me these cups and they're so cute. They're like a four set of Halloween ones and they're super, super thick. I can't remember where she said she got them, but I'm obsessed with them. 
so this cold brew concentrate is what I use to make my coffee. Well, I just started using it like two days ago, but I'm obsessed. Can I stop saying I'm obsessed? This is a concentrate, and little did I know, oh my gosh. Little did I know that this was a concentrate, and I was just using it straight up, but it actually is like low-key really good. I don't cook, I don't clean, I don't need to tell you. More cheek, get down. So you're supposed to fill it up halfway with the water, but I don't want to do that because I kind of like it concentrated. But I use this sweet and condensed milk, and let me tell you, this is Vietnamese coffee vibes. This is the only thing I use to sweeten my coffee. I can't wait to show you guys my art because I don't think I've ever shown my art on my YouTube channel. Just like the random art that I put in my videos, which is just like doodles. But um, these are way more hardcore and serious to me. And they're actually really, really cute. This is my first ever art blog is what I'm going to call them. Oh, oh my gosh, before we continue, I need to show you guys these cups. Dollar store cups. They're so cute and they're actually thick glass. Because I've been looking for the same ones that Ikea has, but I can't find them. I think they're sold out, but these are dollar store. Go get them. If you see some at your dollar store, it's Dollar Tree, one dollar. I want to continue doing weekly art vlogs. We'll see how that really goes because honestly I have a job and um, I don't know if I can commit to that, but it's what makes me really happy at the moment. So I want to continue. Let's do a taste test. Yum, it's so strong. I'm gonna actually add a little water. If you use this concentrate by itself like me because I'm a psycho, it is so strong, but trust me, you'll be like, you will have enough energy to do anything. Oh, I also want to let you guys know I got this too, thinking it was going to be something like this, but it literally looks like throw up water and it tastes like grape juice. I already have a lot of energy and I honestly think it's just because I'm like talking to the camera because I think it makes me feel like I'm less alone and that's another reason why I want to keep doing my art vlogs because honestly I'm so lonely, not to get deep, but like I am. All right, so I have to go do something unnecessary and annoying, but when I get back, this is what is on the to-do list for today. It's like literally two things. Two things that took me five hours. I did way more than two things. So I'm gonna take some pictures for Instagram, my website, and TikTok. So it's basically gonna be like all picture taking all day and just getting stuff on social media. But first I have to go and I'll be right back. Next time you see me, I might have like makeup on. <clears throat> I might be kind of cute, but we'll see actually, I don't know. This is the podcast I'm gonna listen to while I get ready, period. This is my favorite podcast. If you guys want a podcast video, ones that I would recommend, I literally listen to a million and I can make that video for you. For young girlies like me, let me know if you want it. my makeup I put too much blush on but I don't even think you can tell on camera oh I'm sorry Mochi. Oh, I almost stepped on it okay let me show you guys what I got so far I'm really really happy with the inventory that I do have I'm keeping it all in this binder and this is one of the stickers that I made all right so first up we got these cafe stickers I've shown these all over Instagram I think I've shown them on TikTok too so I got some iced coffee blueberry muffin just cafe vibes. This is on a standard matte paper, and this is also on the standard matte paper, but it is laminated. What do you guys think about the laminated thing? I had to fix for the lighting, but these are super special to me because these are planner stickers, and I love to plan. Um, this whole sheet is just like things you can put in your planner. My favorite one is this one that says girls night now these ones are seriously 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 my favorite this is the mystical sticker sheet the stickers on here are seriously so cute let me take one off so I can show you guys with them laminated they just feel like a 3d effect and I am so in love 
with the sticker sheet. This is without it laminated, this is with it laminated. What do you guys think? Let me give you a close-up shot so you can really see. There's mushroom, there's all-knowing egg, a little, what are these called? A snail, shooting star, a little potion bottle, and a candle. Just so cute. Like, these make me the happiest because it's just such... Like, if I saw this in a store, I would honestly probably freak out. Alright, now this one is one that I've shown on TikTok and Instagram. It's called, it says, Working on My Aura, which, if you guys don't, haven't heard the um, song Love Galore by SZA, the version without Travis Scott, she says, Working on My Aura, so that kind of inspired this sticker. I've already put the sticker on a few things, so I'm going to take pictures of that today. This one makes me so happy. I made it yesterday, um, randomly before I was falling asleep, I just thought of this design. It says, do everything in love with a cloud behind it, and like, sunset -y vibes, and then some flowers in the background, and it has that cute little 3D effect. This one's one of my favorites right now, I guess because it's a new product. This one goes crazy, it's called Female Energy, and it has a rainbow background, and it's just all about being girly. This is what I feel like is me and my female energy. It says girls, it has a little planet because girls run the world, rainbow, little manicure, female sign, iced coffee of course, and some cherries. So beautiful. You could put this on anything you want. Um, I think I like them laminated. I haven't made any without laminate, so. This is one of my more recent designs. Look at this. Oh my gosh. Okay, so first off, let's talk about the background. I wanted it to look like lava lamp vibes, and I think I did it. So the header says, imagine, that's what this sheet is called, and it's also lava lamp vibes, I feel like. And just some mushrooms in, what are these called? Uh, leaves and just different kinds of mushrooms. I think these are so cute. You could seriously put them on anything you want to because this is the waterproof um, sticker sheet but I will make some standard uh, matte ones so if you want to put them on planners you can but these can go on like water bottles or your laptop or anything like that. That's everything I have so far for my shop. Um, the rest of the stuff you'll just have to wait and see. I'm still gonna print a little bit more things that I have on my um, iPad to make them into stickers, but for now I'm just going to take pictures of what I have today and get my website set up. So at first I was thinking I really wanted to use Etsy, but I was going back and forth between Etsy and Shopify and I feel like I just really want to use Shopify because I want it to be all my own thing. And I know Etsy is like, it's hard to brand yourself on Etsy, and then whenever you do have Etsy, it's hard to move on from that, so, or that's what I've heard, I don't really know. This is like the first time I've ever really talked on, about it on the internet. Um, I have so many plans for what I want to do with this website, but of course I'm starting out with stickers because that's what I'm passionate about right now. But I'm a 7 on the Enneagram, my passions change all the time. So we'll see where this takes me. Right now I just love stickers and I just want to keep creating stickers and stationary things like that. Um, eventually I just really want to honestly put my designs on so many things. So if you want to stay up to date with what I'm doing in my shop, I'm going to link it down below hopefully. If it's not live by the time I post this, which I don't think it will be actually. I haven't really gotten to set it up yet, but I want you guys to put your email in my website so that way I can send you any updates I have with the shop and you can just get to know what's going on and if there's any sales or promotions. I probably will have some soon for like Halloween and the holidays, which that's another thing I cannot wait to start designing Halloween stuff. September is tomorrow, so I need to start designing it really, really soon, but today I just want to get up my um, regular non-seasonal products. Super sunny wow. outside. Why? Wow. What the heck? Okay, anyways, it's super sunny outside today. It's like the perfect weather to take pictures because there's just a lot of sunlight. Oh my gosh, help, I'm scared. I think the lighting's gonna be good enough, but we'll see. Oh 
Oh my gosh, I'm sweating so hard. I just took all of these photos. They came out so good. Let me show. Look, they came out so good. I love these. I'm gonna put them as the second picture on the website after the cover photo. And yes, I, I only painted one thumb because I knew um, these weren't gonna show up. So, uh, I'm sweaty. After I upload these, I'm gonna try to get ideas of how to do the other part. I'm probably gonna do like water bottles, put them on my switch or something like that. So I'll update you. I'm gonna stop saying that I'll update you guys because it's kind of annoying. Like obviously I'm gonna update you guys. Let me do that. Okay, so this is what I have so far for the front. Oh, I didn't even tell you guys my um, shop name, but it's gonna be Jubilee Studio. I think it's so cute. Um, this is what my shop is gonna look like. And this is where I wanna put those Pinterest vibe photos of like using the products and how they would be really cute in your life. And then this is where my stickers are gonna go. This is where the email list is going to be, so you guys can give me your emails, even if you don't want to get anything, just so you can stay up to date with my shop. I pretty much did everything for the shop, like, as far as setting it up. I just didn't upload the pictures, so I know it's going to take me a minute, and I'm going to do that right now. Alright, I am back. I made some breakfast at 1 p.m. It's a yogurt bowl with some fruit. I'm still setting up my website right now. It's going pretty good. Right now I'm typing in the details for the cafe sticker sheet and how much inventory I have and then I put the photos. Hi Mochi. I'm just gonna keep going through them until I get through the entire thing and then I will go take my pictures. Hopefully by then the sun is down just a little bit so that way I can not be sweating when I do this. Okay, yay. I don't know where I last left off, but I'm pretty much done with the website now. Mm, kind of, but let me show you. If you're seeing this now, you are going to be able to see what the website is like before anybody because I'm going to have a password page and you won't be able to see this. Um, this is going to be the home page and this is where I want to insert the pictures that I'm going to take today. And then if you scroll down right here, this is the collections. So that it's organized by like... These are the sticker sheets, and these are the single stickers. And then at the bottom, I think I already showed this, but that's where the email list is. Then if you click over here in products, here's where the stickers are. So it says sold out because I haven't done the inventory on it yet. But here's all of them. They look so cute. Let me show you what it looks like when you click on them. So there it shows the image. You can add it to cart. By it has a little description and then it has the other picture I took of it. So cute! So I'm not going to work on the website any more than just taking those pictures and putting them on there. But everything else is set and done. Oh, I want to show you what the password page looks like. Really cute. And this is where you put your email so you can get notified when it's open. I still don't have an opening date yet. I want to say maybe late September, early October. No, I want Oct at least October 1st, but Tomorrow's September, so. I just finished editing this video. I'm really happy with it. I love doing these kind of videos, just like vlog style. And I'm gonna be uploading weekly, so I'll see you guys in the next weekly video. It's gonna be another art vlog, but I'm gonna incorporate a lot more stuff into it. It's gonna be super fun. I have like a lot of really fun ideas. Um, so see you in next week's video. Bye! Also, go put your email into the email list on my website so you can be notified when we open, which I decided it's going to be October 1st. Mark your calendars, October 1st. Okay, bye.